one Saturday morning while I was cycling from my home in Balestier to my father's office in New Beach Road. And on the way, I saw a banner, I spotted a banner, it says donate blood, save life. So it got me thinking uh, to be a blood donor so that I can contribute something to the society and save life. My father, when I asked my father for permission to go for donation, and uh, he told me that I have to be committed to it as well as be responsible for it. So a few days later, I started to go to the blood bank at Singapore General Hospital. At that time, I was 18 years old and the nurse told me that uh, as I'm above 18 years old, I need not have to get parental consent because it is the first time you need to, you know, the parents to sign. But for me, above 18, I can go. So uh, that's how I started. And then it became a yearly affair. And uh, I planned for, say, twice or three times a year. Actually, the nurse told me, uh, do not to be scared. But uh, I told them I wasn't scared because I am committed to it. And uh, I'm willing to do my donation and continue donating blood. Yeah. During the third uh, donation, uh, I, when I was in, in the general hospital, when I saw a girl aged about 10 with her mother standing at the entrance of the Singapore General Hospital entrance, so I went up to her and asked her why she was here. And uh, she told me that her father was in hospital and she need uh, blood. So that I started to donate. Uh, I say, do not worry. I will help your father. I will donate the blood for him. You just follow me. And then I went to the counter. That was my first experience. And it also motivated me <laughs> to do more. So I decided to continue uh, donating blood. Well, uh, for the past 52 years, I have donated about 186 times. The life medal to me does not count, number does not count. I, I don't uh, really say count. My main intention, my goal is to uh, save as many lives as possible. That was my main objective in life. So my goal is to just donate, 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 and save as many lives as possible. My achievement is that, that's all. Records, they are the person, they maintain the register and the numbers of donors. You see, Singapore has 1.81 uh, million donors. You just imagine, uh, it's about quite a lot, a fair bit. So, based on their record, I'm one of the uh, oldest and the highest in the country. I try to inspire younger generation people uh, to come forward and donate blood and save lives. The major things I do is in the recruitment programs. I do road shows. I do uh, at the counter service or sometime at the registration area where to uh, explain to those new donors or assist them, provide them uh, assistance 
and also try to get them to donate blood. That is part and parcel of uh, the recurring programs. Yes. I like to uh, share my journey and my experience with all those blood donors and I hope that they will be able to come forward and donate their blood. I hope that the younger generation uh, can come forward and donate blood and the older generation also, age is not counting, they also can come forward and donate blood. As I'm one of the pioneers, if I can make it, I'm sure all can make it. Thank you.